Hey guys, so let's get started. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my eyebrow routine. I really don't do much when it comes to my eyebrows, which is why I kind of held off doing this video for a long time because I don't really have a lot of tricks for my eyebrows. I just fill it in with powder and that's pretty much it. Um, so I do get my eyebrows threaded. I've been getting them threaded for so many years now. And I have this one amazing lady who does my eyebrows and I don't let anyone else touch them. If you get your eyebrows threaded, then you know the struggle of going to a new lady and all that. So yeah, I do get them threaded and um, I usually get my eyebrows threaded every, I would say, two two weeks um, or like two and a half weeks around there when I am in between getting my eyebrows done I do tweeze them a little bit which I will be doing today because I need to get my eyebrows done but I am kind of letting this one grow out a little bit because as you can see this one is a lot thinner especially on the ends compared to this one here this one is like my good brow and this one is just a little messy so yeah so I went to a new lady, um, I didn't have a choice, so I went to a new lady and she made this one too thin. So now I'm trying to grow it out and yeah. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to tweeze a little bit. I do see some little hairs popping out right over here, here. So I'm just gonna tweeze that and then we can get started with filling it in. I just brush it up first so that I can see better and then I will just take out the little extra hairs. Usually, of course, I would do this before I do my full face of makeup, but you know, for this video, we're doing it the other way around. I'm not gonna tweeze this one too much because like I mentioned, I am trying to grow it out. I'm trying to grow a little bit hair on the bottom as well. So I'm not gonna do too much to that. I just brush my eyebrows out and then I'm gonna start filling them in. I don't really have to do much because it's already threaded in the shape that I want. And yeah, I just fill in the sparse areas. I recently actually started using the Tartlet and Bloom palette and I use the shade Activist, which is this color right here. This is a nice dark brown shade and I really like it to fill in my eyebrows. Before I started using the Tartlet and Bloom palette, I was using the Urban Decay Secret Service eyeshadow. I was using this for the longest time, but I'm really liking this Activist shade. So yeah, that's what I'm currently using. Let's get started. I'm just going to brush them out again. I don't know how many times I've already brushed them. Okay, so I'm just going to take a little bit of product and then I'm going to start at the ends. So I like to focus most of the products on the end and then work my way in. Oh, by the way, and the brush that I'm using is a Sonia Kashuk brush. I don't have the number on it because it's so old and rubbed off, but you can use any nice eyebrow like angled brush like this. So yeah, I just create a little arch at the top right here and I just bring it down. So once I'm done the ends, I'm going to brush it out one more time because I don't want to have too much product on it and I want it to blend nicely so I'm continuously just brushing it out. Now what I'm going to do is go into the middle a little bit and then whatever is left on the brush I'm just going to bring it in and as you can see I create like a line here and then I will just flick it up so this eyebrow is done now I'm gonna move on to the other one which is the problematic one So 
So as you can see, I'm just creating a slight arch and just bringing it down towards the ends. I'm gonna brush it again one more time. I just picked up just a tiny bit of product and I'm going to start working it towards my inner part of the eyebrow. So right over here, I don't have a lot of hair. Well, I just filled it in, but yeah, right over there, I don't have a lot of hair. So right here, I don't have a lot of hair. I'm just going slowly and adding little product. You don't wanna have too much on your brush because then it's gonna be really harsh and then it's gonna be hard to blend it as well. So just start with little product and it'll be good. So now what I'm doing is just making that same line, just like up to here. When you bring the eyebrows a little bit closer, it brings your nose closer as well. So that's why I kind of do it. And then what I do is I just flick it up. Whatever is left on the brush is what I'm using. I don't have any extra product. So I'm just taking my brush and brushing it out. I do take my time brushing it out. Um, especially the inner part of the eyebrow because I don't want it to look so boxy and you know I just want it to look natural so I really do take the time to brush it out I'm just going to add a little bit more towards the end and just a little bit here now all I do next is just set it with an eyebrow gel. This one is by Anastasia Beverly Hills and this is just a clear brow gel. I love her clear brow gel. So make sure you use a brow gel. I never used to use a brow gel, but I find that when you do use a gel, it just makes it look a lot more natural and it doesn't look so powdery so that's the main reason why i use a brow gel um it's not because my hair moves around too much it's because i want that natural look and i don't want it to look too powdery so yeah because my hair doesn't move around too much so i lift the hair up especially the inner part of it i lift it up so it looks more fuller and natural what I'm gonna add is a little bit of highlight under the brow bone. I'm just gonna take MAC um, Oh Darling highlight. It will lift your brows if you add a nice highlight underneath. So here it is, the brows all done. I really hope this video was helpful. I know I don't have crazy tricks and tips when it comes to eyebrows but still i hope this video was helpful this is literally what i do if you like this video then please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i would really appreciate it and i will see you all in my next video